What's up? I'm Matt Guff from Buck Hill, and you are seeing the kickoff of the Weekly Wheels Car and Bike Meets. We meet every single week on Wednesdays from 5 to 8 p.m. from today, May 18th, all the way until September 14th. We believe that the best way to grow community is by providing the opportunity for people to enjoy their shared interests. And a lot of people around the area have a shared interest of cars, trucks, and bikes. of this beautiful 1967 Chevrolet Camaro. This is Jesse Garcia. How you doing today? Good. Yeah. Good having us out. Dude, awesome. thanks for being here. Uh, so we, every single week we, we showcase a car and uh, this, is, this is one that I know stood out a lot last year. So we wanted to focus on this one. So tell us, like, how did you come about and come across the car? Well, so first of all, my first car was a Camaro. All 1970 right. 1970 Camaro, so I always wanted another one. And about five years ago, I found this one in North Dakota, went and bought it, brought it back, and did a lot of work that you see here. There you go. Is that, is that the same generation as your 70? Yes. So okay. uh, basically, I mean, the, the Gen 1 is 67, 68, 69, and you got the Gen 2s, 70. So I, had, I technically had a Gen 2, but I always wanted another Camaro, and this is the first year Camaro was made, so what better, uh, what, what better year to have? That's right. Now, what, what's your favorite thing about your car? I'd have to say the motor. Okay. Uh, it's got a 383 stroker. Uh, it's a crate motor from Blueprint Engines in right. Nebraska. Shipped it in, and me and my buddies put it in, and uh, we love it. That's yeah, a great, great motor. To the average person who sees this car, you know, like, what do you think really makes it, really makes it special? Because the engine's kind of hidden, you know, it's a first, first year, you know, Camaro. Like, what else would you say to someone if someone's asked, like, so what, tell me about your car? Well, I think one of the coolest features about the car is the fact that it's got completely wrapped from front to back. So it's not paint that you're looking at. Both the, the base color, which is the matte black, uh, as well as the stripes, it's all wrapped. And it was wrapped by Black Fire Creative, which is one of the sponsors out here. Yeah. Uh, which is great. Adam Kurth is the owner, and uh, they do a great job. Yeah. You know, it's funny. It's like, because underneath this, it's white, isn't it? It is. The car is wide underneath. That's wow. Exactly right. It's a fantastic job, and I love the matte, the matte finish with the, gl the gloss racing stretch. That's I good. That That's good. Thanks. Awesome. Jesse, thank thanks you. so much, and thanks for showing appreciate us the car. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Peace. Creative. This is Adam Kurth. Adam, thanks for being an event partner of ours. Ah, easy day. This yeah. is fantastic. This is, and this is, you guys do some great jobs on, on what you do. But Absolutely. for the people who don't know what Blackfire Creative is, what do you guys specialize in? Well, I'll tell you what, we specialize in commercial and vehicle wraps, uh, graphics, design, uh, and even simple stuff like banners and spot graphics. That's right. The, big uh, stickers. Big stickers. Yep. His, his whole team actually did all the branding for us here at the, the Weekly Wheels, uh, car and bike meets, all the bands that you see on site, and a lot of the cars that you see here today are wrapped by you guys too. Yep, there's quite a few. Now, what, why do you do what you do? How'd you get into this? Uh, it was a long story, but it was on a dare uh, about 23 years ago <laughs> when I was active duty in the Navy. All right. So, hey. And today, 23 years later, we're 100% uh, driven, relationship driven. Awesome. And they, that really shows. As, as we started like to, to build this relationship, we have a, a, an officer that kind of helps us. His name's Jesse Garcia. Uh, officer, as in, like, he helps us with a run, run this aspect of the business. Um, he he kind of introduced us to Adam, and he had you know, only great things to say. And I think, you know, as, as we build this community here at Weekly Wheels, it, it is all about relationships. 100%. So knowing that you, you care about the community, care about your customers the way that you do, it speaks volumes. Yeah, it's the greatest. So we got the best customers in the world. What do you what do you think you love the most about what you do? 
Uh, you know, I, I think at the end of the day, just seeing their faces and their excitement, I think that's what really, that drives us. So, relationships. That's right. <laughs> awesome. Adam, thanks so much. Cool. Thanks Easy for day. serving. Easy day. Thank and, you. of course, thanks for being here. Uh, thanks for having us. Yes. up and what a great time it was at the first weekly wheels car and bike meet for the season again we do these every single wednesday from 5 to 8 p.m all the way until september 14th so make sure to come down we couldn't do this without our event partners twin cities harley davidson blackfire creative qa1 o'reilly auto parts and of course special ed customs so next week stop by buck hill from 5 to 8 p.m and have some fun. See you guys there. Peace.